In this segment, we are going to look at the reasons why we record adjustments at the end of every accounting period. Following general accepted accounting principles, we record transactions under the accrual method of accounting. This method of accounting recognizes, records revenues when they are earned, and expenses are recorded or recognized when they are incurred. This is done because this is the best way companies can measure their profit or loss during a given accounting period. Recording revenues and expenses during the same period during which they are incurred to earn a profit. The other method by which transactions can be recorded is under the cash basis, but this does not follow generally accepted accounting principles. Under the cash basis, revenues and expenses are only recognized when cash is paid. For purposes of financial accounting, we always follow the accrual method. Always remember to record the revenues as soon as they are earned and record expenses as soon as they are incurred, regardless of when cash is received or paid. An example, if ABC paid $2,400 for a 24-month insurance policy beginning December 1st of 2019, if we were following the cash basis of accounting, the full expense of $2,400 would be recorded and reported as an expense in December of 2019. That means no expense related to insurance would be reported during the years 2020 and 2021. Both of those periods are covered by this policy, so some of that expense should have been recorded in 20 and 21, but all of the expense was recorded in 2019. Following the accrual basis, $100 of insurance expense is recorded and reported in 2019, 1,200 of insurance expense is recorded and reported in 2020, and $1,100 of insurance expense is recorded and reported in 2021. This method is matching the insurance expense incurred in each of these years with the revenues that that insurance expense helped earn. Thus, we have a better measure of profits by recording the insurance expense during the periods it is incurred. When doing these adjustments, there are really four types of adjustments that we need to look at. The first types are to look at prepaid expenses or assets that have been used. For example, the prepaid insurance example we just looked through. When we prepay insurance, we are creating an asset. We need to look to see if any of that asset has been used up as an expense during the period. The second type of adjustment is to look at unearned revenues, liabilities that we no longer owe. The third is to look at accrued expenses. Accrued is really just a fancy financial term to mean accumulated. So we're going to be looking for accumulated expenses or accrued expenses that we haven't yet recorded. And finally, we will look for accrued revenues or revenues that we haven't earned, but those revenues have not yet been recorded.